Thank you for the warm welcome. I am Dr. Paradise and I am specialized in cellular agriculture. With meat consumption expected to increase by 73% by 2050. Demand for sustainable, nutritious products to feed the agro population presents a huge problem. Clean meat. Clean meat offers a possible counter response to this, potentially spelling the end of the industrial animal farming, or at least a significant uh, reduction in traditional farming practices. Ladies and gentlemen, by 2050, we won't eat animals anymore. But we still eat meat, <laughs> clean meat, also known by other names, uh, in vitro meat, cultured meat, slaughter-free meat, and lab-grown meat is meat produced by using animal stem cells in vitro. Clean meat is produced by using tissues engineering techniques pioneered in regenerative medicine. And they will make it feel so good. Clean meat has the potential to address the environmental impact of meat production animal welfare, food security, and human health, in addition to its potential mitigation of the climate change. Ladies and gentlemen, clean meat is produced by using animal stem cells in vitro, from uh, embryonic stem cells like this one, and this mess of duck. Uh, to fully differentiated muscle sex, like that one, and it's my favorite. Historically, this was done using fetal bovine serum, collected from the fetus when a pregnant cow is slaughtered. No, not our way, bad, bad boys. Don't try this. However, many companies have now developed a synthetic or plant-based growth media to mitigate 
the ethical issues. Let me check up a bit. Mm, start is not good. Mm, yeah. And this is just oil, don't worry, I don't want to poison you. <laughs> You may ask, was it ever alive? <laughs> was it ever killed? There is no simple answer to this question. <coughs> but, in my personal opinion, it's still better than having animals living cramped in the meat farms where they live only to slaughter. Thus, most effort focus on common types of meat, such as pork, chicken, or, as in our case, beef. Ethical and economic discussion slow down the process. So, the mass production of clean meat is not yet started. It's predicted that consumers will be able to purchase clean meat within the next few years. But today, at the tree of life, we have decided to prepare a huge testing event just for nine of you who are present today in the cellar stage of uh, Terrain Platform in Brno. I'm so grateful to all the staff who host us, who invited us and let us share with you our research, our process, our experiment. We have enough only for nine of you. So, those who would like to participate, <laughs> please come close to the stage. I need some volunteers, please, uh, please no, don't be shy. I'm here with you, everything uh, is safe, controlled uh, from our staff, our scientists who checked all the thing for you also. So please, I need some volunteers, so shy people. I need to come in the audience and pick one by one all the volunteers or there's some, someone brave who would like to stay with me for a while. I will not push you, but uh, I, um, how to say, recommendly uh, hard to, to, to come. Here there is the first uh, line of seats is reserved for you. So, please, someone. Hi. Thank you so much. Anyone else? Oh, thank you for coming. Yes, please. Uh, hey, we are three volunteers. Come on. Uh, don't tell me that Bernau is so full of shy people. We, were be, we will perform our research also in Italy, in Ukraine, and uh, more and more uh, are waiting for us. So don't, lost, uh, don't lose this uh, unique occasion you have. Please. Yes, yes. Uh, so one person there who want to come? Really? The guy? Please, or maybe for sure I, I need to come to the stage. I know I need to come to the audience. One, one more, please. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm from Ukraine. Welcome. <laughs> Welcome in Czech Republic. Anyone? More? I let you all the time. We can stay here all night long. Until <laughs> you can go outside. So I will wait patiently for you. We have four. Anyone more? Do you have the vegan version? Yeah, the left side. <laughs> Is it a vegan version? Pressure. The two guys are uh, talking to each other. They can here. They, they can come here and talk here with us, please. 
Oh yes, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. So we need uh, maybe three more. <laughs> You're gonna make me uh, not uh, work tonight. <laughs> huh? So, I will come to speak with you. Uh, is, is, it vegan? Weeks. is it vegan? Uh, yes, yes. Uh, of I would not uh, spoil it, but uh, it's our vegan version of vegan. <laughs> so, also vegans to join us. Please. From Mexico, they told me there is some volunteer, you know? <laughs> not so much volunteer, but... Uh, <laughs> Let's do it. Oh, yeah, thank you so much. And here, there may be someone want to rush uh, to the first uh, line of it. Oh, thank you so much. Maybe one last spot for the last uh, great person. No. Oh, wow, thank you so much. Good luck to make it, but yeah. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> you. Thank you so much. Now, I would like uh, to ask you one more thing, if you can stand uh, with me here. And just let uh, the audience see in the eyes of the bravest uh, people uh, in Brno, please. <laughs> just, just you mean, I don't want uh, Yes, please, please, just stay for a while. I'm gonna to change my clothes to prepare myself uh, for the ritual. I suggest you to do the same in our inner uh, spirit and mind, and then we can start.
Carmen da dare da mangiare a tutta questa gente perché loro piangono davanti a me dicendo dacci della carne che possiamo mangiare dall'albero della conoscenza del bene e del male poiché il giorno in cui tu ne mangerai di sicuro morirai
miles of journey to remind me I give it freely to anyone who comes to me. You just need to accept my need in your own need. Feel it my flesh and drink my blood. Believe in me. Accept me as Redeemer. He remains in me. And in the same way, I remain in him.
Every nine years, nine men enter the house for that I deliver them from all evil. I can hear their steps and their voices in the depths of the stone galleries and I run joyfully to find them. The ceremony lasts a few minutes. They fall one after another without my having to bloody my hands. They remain where they fell, and their bodies have distinguished one gallery from another. I do not know who they are, but, but they know that one of them prophesied me at the moment of his death. The someday is my redeemer would come. Since then, my loneliness doesn't pain me because I know my Redeemer lives and he will finally rise above the dust. Mm. Mm. If my ear could capture all the sounds of the world, I should hear his steps. I hope he will take me to a place with fewer galleries and fewer doors. What will my Redeemer be like? I ask myself, will he be a bull or a man? Will he perhaps be a bull with the face of a man? Or will he be like me? Will he be like me?
our human sayings being humane means to be behave like animals means to be evil but we were always so similar I think we should grow together with the other species into something better, into something more natural.